when I when I moved to New York, I started doing research, asked a lot of interior designers. Um, I actually met with Coleman and Kravis, and um, she told me about. She first told me about this school. I asked other designers, and everybody said that if you were going to go back to school, that New York school was definitely the place to go. I, I had several other choices, um, but I did choose this school primarily because of the smaller class sizes and the teachers are professionals themselves. I was impressed by the campus, uh, by the building, the facilities, the, um, particularly the uh, technical uh, facilities, the computers, also the lighting lab. Uh, I felt that it was uh, an attractive and, and up-to-date environment. This school has a tremendous uh, faculty, and I really have had a phenomenal experience with each and every one of them. New York City has always been something that I've always wanted to see. And when I came out here to visit the school, it was that point that I decided that I, I really wanted to be in New York City. Um, the campus is located pretty much smack dab in the middle of Manhattan. And um, it's really easy to get to all the museums and everything that you need to go to visit for school. I think the, the school is located so well because it's within distance of the the de of the design building and it's within you know walking distance of so many important antique shops and galleries that it makes it very uh, it allows the student to not only go to school but also uh, explore wonderful products at the same time I think the facilities at the school are phenomenal the the computers the technology constantly being upgraded and improved it's it's truly it's wonderful nice facilities are kept up very well um, they're up to date. They have really great computer systems and just a very helpful resource. One of the most important things that the school has to offer in the way of facilities is the library. Uh, there's some wonderful books that are, are not easy to find that uh, are exceedingly helpful in a wide variety of subjects. Um, and I would say definitively that I could not have gotten through the program to this point and performed as well as I, I hope that I have without being able to tap this resource. That's fantastic. Part of the facility that I really find so useful is the atelier. Um, they have a lot of fab I mean, the fabric samples in there, the use for projects, as well as the computers um, for AutoCAD and other homework assignments. It's just great. Um, I, was, I was starting my second career and I always, I think I always knew that I wanted to um, become an interior designer. Coming back to school in a career change was challenging but very exciting and I recommend a change of heart for anyone. I would consider myself a career refiner but uh, my decision to come to the school would represent a change of career. It was very intimidating to come back to school, I must say, as a second career. Um, there were people my age, but there are more people who are younger. Um, however, I found that once I got into the atmosphere, people really didn't care about that. Um, I certainly didn't care about it. And um, I think the professors also uh, respect the fact that I'm a working professional. I must say that uh, the semester before I started at the New York School of Interior Design, I interviewed for a job uh, for a client, and I wasn't hired because I didn't have the, the educational background, and that really threw me for a loop, and kind of, you know, it just made me realize that I had to go to school, and I'm so much better for having gone to school. The classes uh, here emphasize residential and commercial. Um, at the end, in the last couple of years, there's a little bit more emphasis on commercial. I like the I like the fact that the school focuses on historical styles of furniture. For example, I think that's indispensable to creating any interior. Is to understand we have to know our past to know where we're going in the future. When I came to the school, I had not taken an art class since eighth grade, so I had no portfolio. I came in here. I started in the basic interior design program. Um, and then transferred into the associates and then transferred into the bachelors um, by turning in portfolios that I accumulated while working here at the school. And I think that the school is wonderful in the way 
Uh, it creates wonderful cultural programs, dialogues with designers. The school is always bringing the design community in, in its doors, which I think is very important for, for the student body to interact with the design community. The coursework is very rigorous. It is not for the lighthearted. The school is wonderful in the fact that it's, it's big, but it's not so big that it's overwhelming. But every professor knows who you are, which is wonderful. And, they, and it's a treat to have a professor come up to you and tell you how they, see, how they see your work is progressing and such through the years, even though you may have had them your first semester at the school. I've pretty much liked all of my professors. They all really enjoy what they're doing, and they all know what they're doing. Um, they're all working professionals. This school has a tremendous uh, faculty, and I really have had a phenomenal experience with each and every one of them. Um, they're all, for the most part, practicing architects um, or interior designers. They can give you firsthand knowledge. They, they share experiences day to day on what happens to them in the field. Absolutely, I think that because most of our professors are architects or designers themselves, they really know uh, what what you need when you start working in the real world. My impression of the faculty at the school is that they are the greatest asset uh, that the school has. The school is takes a vested interest in each one of the, the students and their progress and their growth as designers. And uh, it was wonderful how helpful the school was in, in putting me in contact because uh, probably still be looking for a job if I didn't have those, uh, those connections made. I could not draw a stick when I first started at this school and I think I'm kind of known for my perspectives now. So I think you just have to be diligent and don't be afraid. Just don't be afraid. If you don't know how to do something, just if you work really hard at it and you get a great professor, don't be afraid to ask. If you put the effort in, you'll do well. It's, um, and it's a good work environment too. Every, all the teachers are very helpful, the students are the same, and um, everyone, we create a su support system. It's a, it's a really great atmosphere. I um, went up to the career placement office um, this past summer and told them that I was looking for a new job. Um, and I started going through career placement through them, and I found a job within three weeks. I have used the career placement services here. Um, they helped me look over my resume and check for any mistakes and really made sure I was printing, presenting myself well. I had five interviews and I received five offers. I've been uh, here at the school for two years and I'm enjoying every minute of it. The education I received has put me at such an advantage. I feel that I've just kind of absorbed like a big sponge here and um, whatever they would give me I would take and hopefully I gave uh, some back.